Cindy A. Lewis here. Welcome to my channel, your channel, our family. Uh, thank you so much for joining me today. Today's video is going to be sort of the diamond painting type video uh, instruction. Just kind of a take a look at these little kits. I did a preview on a live. It was just super quick. So I wanted to show you this is the greeting card size. So it won't overwhelm you like a big, like eight by 10 or bigger. Um, it's super fun. I have to say, I really enjoyed it. And it is by Crafters Companion. They had these on HSN a couple months ago. They probably still have some. But anyway, that I got a couple of them. I had never tried it, to be honest. And it's so easy. So super easy. So um, we're going to get into this in just a second. I am really excited to have you here joining me tonight. So if you're new, welcome. And I'd love for you to subscribe if you are interested in these types of videos, all kinds of DIYs and hauls and all kinds of fun. And uh, let's just jump right in. What do you think? <laughs> All right, so let's go over what's in this kit. Um, both kits have cards and envelopes that go with them, plus all the um, little jewels or gems that you put on your cards. So this one's called Glitz and Glamour, and um, the designs are here, so we'll see that. So I just wanna show you, get all the gems, and you get the... Uh, extra cards that you get four and they're really really cute so you can see they come the adhesive is on the card already and so you just want to pull back this little sheet protective sheet as you're working on it it does come with instructions but i'm telling you it's so super easy that um, once you get used to doing it 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 will be flying all right, so this is the card that I've been working on. Here's my sheet. I just have a few more little pieces to do on this one, and it is just adorable. Now, I did research, just real quick, because I know you're gonna ask, does it need um, some kind of cover or like uh, Mod Podge or some kind of acrylic um, over it to um, make the gem stick? No, it does not. I did read about that. The sites actually don't recommend putting any glue over it. So normally it will come like this, and as you work it, you just pull this up and work on it. So let me show you all the gems that come with it come in a bag. They have their own separate little bag, and then they come with extra bags for you to put them in there. They all have a lettering system so whatever ones you're using and then you just put them in this bag once you've opened it so that you can um, keep them separated uh, i know it would be hard if you couldn't so they come on a strip let's see this one's still together and they're just lettered like uh, o p r s t u v you know that kind of thing so what you do is you look for the letter that it tells you on here. So I'm just gonna show you real quick. Um, the They are very small. So you would have to look at that little um, dot and you say, oh, okay, these are M or N or C or, or whatever. So they're really, really cute. Now what comes with it is this little tray and it has ridges in it. And that helps make sure your gems turn over. And then it comes with this little tool here. And this is a little piece of wax. And so when you need to pick, for picking up your gems, you just get wax on your little tool. You just stick it in there. You can see different marks where I've done that. And then you'll just pick up your gems and put them on your card. Okay, so to finish this shoe, I need the ends. I need a couple more O's up here and here, and then I need P. So I'm just gonna pull this off because I'm at the end of it anyway. So I need O. Let me see if I have O opened yet. I don't think I do. 
So I'm just going to open O here. And I'm just going to cut that little piece out. So what I'm doing is cutting the little bag. And then I'm going to grab one of these little bags to put it in when I'm done. So then I'm just going to open this up and pour a few. Now I'm not going to pour them all. I'll just pour a few in here of the gems. And some of the gems seems like there's something that, you know, like maybe they got mixed up or whatever, but most of them are good. And when you shake it, those ridges help turn those gems over, which is what you want. So then you take your little tool with wax on it and you just pick up the gem like that. And then this is O. So I want to find all the O's and I just stick it on there. It's that easy. So just pick it up and stick it. So let me get you down a little bit closer here. Here we go. And just pick up the gem on the tool and the adhesive is already there. I want to have a little bit of wax. So let's get that off there. There we go. And then I'm telling you, it's very therapeutic. It's almost like coloring. Really fun. And it's that easy. Seriously. Super easy. All right. So let me get this. And then as your um, wax runs out or whatever pushes up in there, you just stick your little tool in the wax and pick up some more. And isn't that pretty? I mean, it just really is glitzy and glamour. Now when I'm through with a certain color, I just put it back in the baggie and put the bag uh, inside one of these little tiny, it's like a little Ziploc bag or whatever, and just seal it and then I can see which one it is. So next I'm going to just finish this up so you can see it finished. So that's, I'm going to get P and N and show you how it looks at the end. All right, there it is, and it is adorable. Now, you could leave it just like this, put your sentiment on the inside, and send your card in your envelope, because they give you an envelope just to do that. Or you could embellish it. You could uh, mat it and put it on a bigger card, or you could put it in a journal. You could put it in, you know, a scrapbook. I mean, in a frame. You could frame your artwork. It's just so pretty and really, really enjoyed putting it together. Um, I love that it's shiny and sparkles and just makes you happy. So the other three in this kit are this beautiful skirt, um, this gorgeous dress, and then the purses, which are so cute. And then the other kit has um, balloons, birthday cake, champagne and glasses and tea and cakes. So cute, can't wait to play with these some more. But I did wanna show it to you. I have had no trouble with the gems. Uh, they stick really well and none of them have fallen off. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video to inspire you to try something new. Talk to you later. Bye -bye.